What, what, what do you want? What are you doing? What? Nothing. Just, what, what do you want? You're obviously doing something. You have all your editing stuff open. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what we're doing for the Christmas special on Pwn. We already did the Star Wars Holiday Special. We did The Last Jedi last year. There's no Star Wars this year, so I don't know what to do. Wow, that's tragic. Hey, you aren't exactly helping me here, Jack. Why would I want to help you? Pwn is stupid. When is Donna the Damned coming out? Get out. <sighs> hey, you dropped your... What's the doobie? Alright, have you ever seen The Dark Knight before? That's The Dark Knight Rises, the thing I've seen. Ari, get the boys together. We're watching a movie. Wes. Yes? It's The Dark Knight. I'm on it. Oh shit, I locked myself out of my phone. Joey? Hello, Wesley. You know what to do. Is, is it really happening? Bet your Italian ass it is. I'll be there soon. <clears throat> well, hi, Joey. The last time I saw you, we were filming Dawn of the Damned. How are you? What? Oh, sorry. This is the uh, wrong number. Don't even tell me, Joey. I'm already on my way. Is it really happening? Are we really doing a good pwn? I hope so. This is gonna be a big one, Lucan. Meet us at Ari's in 12 seconds. I'll be there, man! I'm here! Hi, I'm Ari. <laughs> <laughs> I've called you all here for a very important, very special a most sacred tradition. <laughs> in all of Pwn history, there has been only one film exciting enough, action-packed enough, the most entertaining thing that has ever existed. Behold! <coughs> How did that get there? Behold! The Dark Knight! Witness the power of the greatest... <coughs> <laughs> Behold the dark the video game. The dark night. Dude, yeah, that's the dark night. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going home. Prepare yourself. That's the DVD of Lords of Arabia. To watch <laughs> Behold. To anyway, watch Joey, as the Dark Knight. That's the Dark Knight. This is pawn number 15.
Not going in. There we go. Hi, I'm Art Froelich. I'm Nick Gohan. I'm Luke Canalto Stagiati. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello, I'm Ari. I'm Nick. I'm looking up the stuff, Johnny. I'm Joey. And I'm a Dark Knight. And welcome. Rises. <laughs> That's the Dark Knight. That's the Dark Knight. That's the Dark Knight. That's the Dark Knight. I'm Dark Knight. Hello, and welcome to Pwn episode number 30. Uh, today, we're going to be talking about a, a movie that I'm sure all of us are very excited to talk That's about. That's the Dark Knight. <laughs> That's correct, Ari. It is the Dark Knight. Ooh. The Dark Knight. Which we have probably mentioned <coughs> many countless times on Pwn before. Definitely not countless, it's a number. Uh, this number to be exact. But I think really? it's Can you give yourself that word? Who's the main character of The Dark Knight? No, I'm just trying to say Batman. Batman. Who directed Batman? Batman. From the very first episode of Pwn, we've been talking constantly about the Dark Knight, and finally we get to talk about it some more. Because prior to today, prior to today, neither Ari nor Luke had seen it, and Joey had only seen it once during the, the Kroger Club marathon and while asleep. I was sleeping. And definitely <laughs> fell asleep. So we have three people here today with new perspectives. Two who have seen this at least 12 times each. I was gonna say, let's do an, uh, an animation segment, but with five people, I know this is gonna go horribly wrong, but in interest of this video not being we'll put that in the post. 50 minutes <coughs> long, um, I guess we'll just get started. So, Wesley. Or just do an animation section. Woo! So Heath Ledger is Batman, except negative. In the beginning, he can't move his neck and he's fighting a man called Scarecrow. And once the scarecrow dies, then no one's scared anymore. And it's like it, except the clown is the Batman. There's also a hungry dog that will come in late at the play. So if you don't, if you if you don't care about those hungry dogs, you're gonna be mistaken about the plot of this film. So so in the beginning of the film, uh, there's a bank heist. Joker kills all of his men and takes $96 million in cash that's radioactive and now he hides it away and he took it from the mob. And then he gets superpowers because the cash is radioactive and he becomes Cash Man. <laughs> Superpower he, he, number he, he one. He becomes cash. cash Money. Number two. Cash. So then, like, what was your plan for this? Like, what <laughs> yeah, well, I don't know. I like how this I is like the one animation. unscripted episode. You can't lead it. You have to wait for Nick to lead it and then pretend like you're leading it But lead it in somewhere intentionally, you know, he doesn't want it to go. Would you like to lead then Wesley if you're gonna sit there and complain? <laughs> so black mirror. Oh my god. All right, fine. I'll cut the other two out of the video So now that it's just the three of us um, Hi, I'm Ari. Okay. No, 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 no. Yeah, wait. You know what? Animating was a bad idea. <laughs> Animating was a bad idea. <laughs> what? So, dude. Uh, dude. And then Batman jumps out of a building, and then Commissioner Gordon gets fake shot. Wait. Oh my God! It's the actual no, plot of the real movie. shot. Wait, that was like a real shot. Oh, he does. He gets real he gets shot, shot by fake the Joker. Dead. The Logan. bulletproof vest. It's always the bulletproof Why? vest. It's can Kevlar. We, it's we, always what, Kevlar, we, right, Mamma? Fake shot in the what? Joker. Yes. Right? Yes. Whatever you say. Yes. I'm awesome. Dead. I have <laughs> a thing to propose. <laughs> what the car chase been better if it was all one shot? Because <laughs> I think it will. Why the poster the post or something? I'll, I'll show you. I'll Why did the boat happen? Yeah, it makes no sense. Okay, maybe he burns like a jillion okay. dollars. You know he doesn't make sense. No, the car chase is fine. The car chase is amazing. I'm fine. I don't like the car chase. Hey, hey, I'm taking this really? back under control. He just said he doesn't like the car chase. Before seeing this movie, Wes and I had seen it. Wes, you love this movie. But you don't like it as much as Inception. Correct. Meaning it is your second favorite Christopher Nolan. That is not how logic works. Oh, the Christmas. I guess the movie Nolan. in general. No, you did not say that. <laughs> that is correct. What you and said. it is in your top 15 at least movies. Yes. Okay. I love this movie as well. It's in my top 10. Okay, it's number four then. <laughs> no, okay. you said number one two hours ago. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> what's, um, what's your number one movie? Lords of Arabia. Really? But so Joey. You, you, Austin, <laughs> Joey, you remember vaguely watching this movie when we did our marathon? 
very vaguely. But did you enjoy the parts of it that you did comprehend? Yeah. Okay. Luke, and you knew nothing about it going in, but you were expecting it to be good? Um, I was actually expecting it to be mediocre. That's Luke, not what you didn't said say in the video. Luke, and having never seen The Dark Knight, what, what do you think? I think it's gonna be a fine movie. You have good or bad <laughs> feelings going in? You, you set the bar very, very, very high. I'm expecting it to be better than Dark Knight Rises because I didn't know what was happening because I didn't see the Dark Knight. Because I thought Dark Knight Rises was the first one because it's Rises, but apparently there's Begins in Dark Knight as well. Yes, that is true. It makes no sense. And did it meet it? Oh, now we're going to the end. Oh, shoot. Now I'm the first of the full review. <laughs> yeah. Holy crap. Yep. I thought it was a very good movie. Beyond just your expectations, what what about it particularly? Would you say that you liked it enough to have it like in the top anything? Yeah, I think the context was not as good because I think all the lines that are like like mythic to this movie are very cheesy because you guys use them all the time. <laughs> so every every line in that movie almost is an inside joke for you guys. I hear it all the time. It so it's just like is. yeah, it's because I can like recite the script. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Exactly. So it's like that kind of dampens the effect a little bit, but I mean, the writing's good, the scripting is good, so that's the same yeah. thing. I thought it was very good. Hey, and that's what I said. As someone who doesn't like well, superhero movies. Well, get an original movies. opinion over here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaking, I, I do not like superhero movies at all, but I Give like an example of superhero movies. That you don't like. And some that you <laughs> all of them. Well, <laughs> this one. Except yeah. Deadpool. So, yeah. Lucan. Yeah. What did you think of The Dark Knight? I think it was good, but there's some points in this movie that just really just 100% take me out of it, and I'm watching it, and I think this is like, this is a dumb pop point. Alright, so what would an example of that be? The entire movie, not the entire final fight was Joker, but the entire boat thing. Kind of. Because it, it doesn't... <laughs> no, okay, wait. Not, not kind of. Now that I think about it, it's perfectly fine. No, no, no it's not perfectly fine. First of all, how does the thing not blow up at 12? Because, because the Joker, Joker was going to detonate it himself. Okay, then why? Which one of these is going to blow up? He's going to blow up both. going to blow up both. That wasn't betrayed at all. Yeah, it was. Wait, it was. Everyone That's was exactly There's a line he said, said, he says over the intercom. If you don't you blow up each other, then I'm going to blow up. At midnight, I blow you all up. If, however, one of you presses the button, I'll let that boat live. If, if, you, if and then one of these says, boats oh, isn't blown up, so I guess like, I take it back. Well, well they, movie. no, but then they would obviously blow up the convicts, even if they're all gods, because they would have to protect c civilian lives. Are you saying the convicts police aren't and civilians? security guards on the convicts? No, boat. but they couldn't do it. They didn't have the balls. They, 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 they don't have their own They didn't have the balls. They have the other it. boat's detonator. Each of you has the remote. Blow up the other boat. So then they would just convoy to, in some way, because the radio's gone, it would swim to the You're not allowed boat. to. That was another thing he said. If anyone tries to leave, I blow you all up. Anyone attempts to get off their boat, you all die. Well, this then, is all set up, Luke. And, well, and then the, the, the security guard should have probably just thrown out. <laughs> they did, they did what they did. <laughs> what they did. I take it back to Steve J. <laughs> I still don't like it because it's dumb. If it makes me question why this is happening, it's not a good scene. I find it 100% dumb. I do not like how this is the Joker's final solution on how he's going to kill us. <laughs> This is no, his final no, joke on the city. <laughs> no. How this is like his big thing to get this back at Batman. This is just a prank, guys. There's a camera here. <laughs> Here's a prank. Tonight, you're all gonna be a part of a social experiment. Look, and he he just for the sake of it, he just burnt a how much money? A lot of a money. Lot, a, a lot, lot of, of money. money. A lot of it. And half a of the money ever. Yeah. He did yeah, burn he, it. And he also burnt his allowance. allowance. He he said even before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really, really. Got really? One. Okay. That was really okay. good. That, I could see that. that came out of nowhere. Right. It was it was quickly came up with. Before fast. the boat scenes, it was good he delivery. sets up that like the entire city has to play by his game. They probably should have done like the entire city is an anarchy, and I know that's called the Dark Knight Rises. Well. This came out first, before the Dark Knight Rises. Oh, thank they you. Did. They probably should have had it like, what's gonna be blown up first, like... Wait, is like, that what I'm kind of sure where it's coming from. Are you kind of sure? I, I, yeah. Yeah. Can, like, I, I okay. the Joker God. better no, than the Joker. Think about Joker this. He said, weird. by, by, Do you like, know what Midnight Joker Tonight, is? I see where, by Midnight Tonight, he says, this entire city is gonna be mine, but then why does he... 
mm -hmm. do that by only like yeah. talking about That's such the small entire scale. city's not on two boats. Yeah. Okay. Do you know what no, 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 no. I can answer that literal. question. Ari understands but it. Not it's on a boats. it's a, How are they it's a thing. Up? Up? If he does it with just these people, then what's to stop him from doing it with everyone else, okay? Well, he can't. Why didn't he just do it with everyone else? Because you can't get everyone... Yeah, he doesn't want to blow everyone it's a, up. It's a principle. He wants to put him in the chaos. It's, it's setting a precedent. No, Nick, I could prove your point wrong, because the National Guard could have been like, well, I'm legally obligated to protect these citizens and not the convicts, so I'm just going to blow up the convicts. I don't think convicts are citizens. No, they're not. Yeah, they are. You are still <laughs> yeah, wait, no, they still are citizens. citizens. Yeah, certain <laughs> rights are taken away. But you, you are but still an American. But not citizenship. Here's yeah. another point. Positive. The people not on the boats. <laughs> Did you look just don't pay attention to the camera. Yeah. Come on. There should have been a citywide scale. You have also, you have to choose in between blowing up a large population of citizens or they're both a large, a large population, population of citizens. citizens. No. No. <laughs> they're still no. Worse. Every citizen has to turn in someone they know to a certain place and shoot them themselves either if if you don't turn in the head of one person, you are not allowed to leave the island, or you're not allowed to leave Gotham, and... But he doesn't the want to murder city. half yeah. the population. Yeah, he, that's, he's, he's not, not Thanos. Thanos. <laughs> <laughs> no, if you don't turn in at least a, a head of somebody, or a dead body, if you... At least? Like someone's gonna be an overachiever? <laughs> but it, it would prove how crazy people are, that they'll kill multiple people okay, but to he's have doing the chances that. Okay. Yeah, but you can do that and, with just two boats. And, and if not they, if we're not in statistics, me and Ari get it. You take a sample size and it represents the whole population. No, it doesn't! It Where would be better if... go? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, after a certain time limit, a, a chemical gas would be relieved to turn everyone crazy, like Wait, how the oh, original so Batman. Uh, no, that's a Batman the joke. The point isn't to turn to like use a chemical gas to turn everyone crazy. It's to show that people are crazy inside. He's he's showing mm -hmm. that they can be corrupted. yes, and, and they are corrupted by killing people to leave the island for themselves. He that's what well, he is. succeeds. That's what the the plan was to do. Think about it: a man killing his wife because he wants to live and doesn't care about his family. That would prove the Joker's point. I and now so Bat with the boat. I'm not saying the Joker as a character is terrible, I'm saying okay, his plot. Maybe Luke can should terrible. stop. <laughs> before you okay, commit yourself okay. any further. Well, well, yeah, before before we need to bring back Hitler and okay. gas people. I'm sorry, he literally, he literally said he wanted to bring back Hitler. He a has a final solution, solution. He wants to gas, gas people. City. <laughs> sorry, FBI. <laughs> I fed you, alright? So, <laughs> my idea is a good idea. <laughs> That's what Hitler said. That's just about no. That's what Hitler told all of you that it works. Here's what I don't like: how Joker says that this is a citywide. Is this your struggle? Oh, to try and get this back on topic. It was on topic. We were talking about the movie. We were fixing everything. Okay. You may not agree with my point, but I'm. <laughs> okay, okay. Why did the Joker think this was a good idea? Because it's not. Logically, <laughs> it's not a good idea. They're gonna die, dude. It's yeah. not a good idea, man. No, they should be killed. <laughs> no, why no, they, they, so. no, they, they sue it. The they, the they sue it out, you saying so the convicts are better to kill all the all actual prisoners. citizens. Yeah, that, yeah. That is close. <laughs> there are a lot of <laughs> things. Point number thirty. Please. The boat scene. Let's from talk about why. There's a lot of things that this movie sets up ahead of time. Wes, Wes can back me up here. I'd say almost every single line of dialogue after the bank heist for the first like 20 minutes at least is setting up other things, right? Because we find out about Wurtz and Ramirez ha being like not trustworthy. We find out that Ramirez, because it's like a, Ramirez has just gotten back from the hospital with her mom. Ramirez's mom being in the hospital is part of what the Joker uses to convince. It's, it's all sorts of stuff going on there. And, and it's all expertly well done. There is, of course, the most obvious It's example, like a web, if you will. Which is... Like that superhero. If you... Spider-Man. With man. great... Do you know what is a good scene? <laughs> the boat scene. <laughs> Dude, yes. what, what scene is actually amazing? The car chase. <laughs> you know, I think I would like the boat scene if the boat scene wasn't involved. One take. <laughs> no. All right, take back my statement about the one thing about the car chase. We'll get to that later. But okay. I think the boating would be better if it was just the hostages. The hostages are dressed up as the bad so guys, the and the yeah. and the SWAT people are gonna shoot the clowns. But those are actually the hostages. I don't if think that's that, big enough. So what actually happens in the scene? 
I don't you just think. said, why did he do a citywide thing on such a small I, scale? No. Then you just said, it should have been smaller. Just the it should have been everyone in the city is the hostages. <laughs> <laughs> and they think the whole city's full of clowns. <laughs> the reason that all those clowns are there is it's the boat scene sets it up. Because so, he, he, he wants us to come after them, right? He wants mm-hmm. to be found there. <clears throat> and the, the boats are like part of the reason he's there. Yeah, all right, I want you to tell us some specifics about what you, why, why you really like this movie. And then it's actually even better. We'll start with Wes, and then we'll hear some news. Why is Wesley better than ours? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I know. Wes, no. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Even better. <laughs> Wes, who has seen it for the for the tenth time, and then Ari, who has seen it for the first time, just on a surface level. Because, like, I'm assuming you didn't, like, deeply analyze every aspect you of it, You don't know right? me. I mean, I don't. I turn on the subtitles so I can hear it over you guys. It's chattering. Yeah, that's true. That's true. So you have a good understanding of this movie then, right? So then we'll start with you. I never said that. I never said that. <laughs> Quite bad. What makes this a great movie? The action sequences. They're very well choreographed. Great. And they all make sense. And I like plans in movies that kind of like unravel and they really make you feel like, aha, that makes sense. Or like, oh, he did that. Like if you've seen Ocean's Eleven. It's all like, oh, that's actually cool. It was all planned. I didn't know it was. Joey. Does any of that make sense? Yeah, yeah. No, I get it. I get it. I definitely agree with that. The planning that comes out. I agree with movie. the previous speaker. <laughs> In terms of a superhero movie, also, a lot of them are kind of like super happy and like he's coming to save the day and everyone loves Superman and all that. I think it was really cool how they made it like dark. Yeah. Exactly. Like what? Because like the act, like, big life, character yeah. actually dies. I wasn't expecting that, so it actually like adds more suspense to what happens. Yeah. Well, you liked Jim Gordon coming back to life then? That that took you by surprise? Yeah. Even having seen Dark Knight Rises, that took you by surprise. Yeah, yeah, yeah that took me... No, it didn't take me by surprise because I knew it was coming back. But, like, it surprised me that um, Rachel actually died. I really? think yes, I was surprised I by the that. Jim Gordon because I didn't know when he was coming back. Another thing that kind of hurt this movie for me is because, like, each scene that was referenced in College Humor is Batman. <laughs> I kept thinking of... <laughs> I kept thinking of... Uh, but that's not this movie's fault. <laughs> I know, I know. It's just, like, I didn't see it soon enough. Well, actually, like, the, the really annoying guy who knows Batman's identity, yeah. he's the Riddler. Oh, my God. What? Really? Yeah. Wait, uh, what? Kind of. Like, not... Is not, this like, a fan actually, theory, but... or...? Well, no, it's, like... I guess. I don't know if it's been confirmed or not. Wait. There's the a Dark Knight no isn't the here. first one in a trilogy? Nah, it's the Batman Begins. Sorry, man. You, you know that? I thought this was the first movie. I thought this was the first one. Well, no, because like, I know, watched the last one thinking it was the first one. I, I, saw, I saw Dark Knight Rises. I thought this was the first one. I thought so Dark Knight sure. Rises was the second one. <laughs> and Batman Begins was the third I one. Thought, <laughs> I thought I didn't know what the third you, one was. You can't blame us for this I awful thought, I thought thing. Batman Begins was a different Batman. <laughs> that makes sense, though. But it's good that it can stand alone, then. No, I was going to lead that how I liked how Harvey Dent's character was built up. Can, should I should I elaborate yeah, on that? Should okay. I should I dive into a new topic? And then we can talk about a few other there? characters. Okay. What did you do? You need a do you need a new paper towel to clean my uh, thing with? I think you can make do. I I liked how in the beginning of the movie he's just he's just a guy. He's a lawyer. He's he's rich. He has a bunch of friends. And then because, just a guy, lawyer, of rich the, friends. And in, in the end, Joker says that I have a straight gun. For and that was my. I, no, no, no. <laughs> I, I, I have destroyed Gotham's White Knight. And throughout the entire movie, because of Joker's actions, you see Harvey Dent getting more corrupt. Oh, which adds another layer to the boat scene. It really does. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. What the boat? Actually, if you think when about it. When he's on the boat with, with the, 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 boat, with yeah. the ballerinas. The boat scene and Harvey Dent's are pretty much the same thing because Joker's trying to convince the world that. Um, you can convince that normal people are actually uh, crazy and awful like he is. We're gonna do a little bit of a character study here, and I'd like to get Wes in on this because he hasn't said much. Yeah, Wes. Did he Ledger win an Oscar Grammy for this He one? did, posthumously after his death. He a Grammy? Grammy? Ledger got no, best I mean, supporting I, I was just saying, <laughs> a I, Grammy I, I actually didn't know, I didn't know he actually <laughs> won something for it. He won, yes. He died. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, he, he died? died? He Ledger's been dead for 10 I almost forgot. Wait. 
This is okay. The reason we're doing the Dark Knight now is because it's the 10 year anniversary of the Dark Knight coming out. Is it really? Not today. It was, this it? was supposed to come out in July. <laughs> but the reason we're talking about the Dark Knight at all is because it's been 10 years. <laughs> Heath Ledger's been dead for 10 years. Can you do me a favor? He died the year this for nine years. Yeah, he died before months. it came out. Yeah. What? Really? They finished production and it hadn't come out yet, though. What did he die from? Overdose. Overdose of some manner. Antidepressants. That'd be, that'd be true. That's a whole nother layer. That's what I want to talk about, is how wonderful he is in this. <laughs> you understand the joke, guy? What's the joke? <laughs> it adds a whole nother layer, like you say, because a lot of people theorize that part of why he got depressed in the first place is Heath Ledger's an insane method, method actor, actor, right? Like, insane levels. A lot of these characters are. Gary Oldman is a method actor. Uh, as, Christian as, Bale is definitely yes, a method actor. Yes, full-on actor. method actor. <laughs> Apparently, he, Heath Ledger locked himself in a hotel room for a month and just, like, was sitting there slowly going to understand better crazy people, right? Like, so, he put in a lot of this. Some people think the movie killed him? Uh, a lot, yeah, a lot of people he, think that his character he study did his is what makeup. caused him. To, he did his own makeup, that's right, he designed it himself. <laughs> Everyone loves Heath Ledger's performance, but... D- did you just say it? Everyone loves the Joker's <laughs> performance in this. I uh, love, I love his performance. All right. Yeah, just I not think, very Why did you say it? <laughs> no, because I, I'm, I'm trying to compare it to. He's allowed to have the, the uh, Jared Leto, the old, the old Jack Joker. Nicholson. Yeah. So who's a better Joker, Jack Nicholson or Heath Ledger? Jared Leto. He <laughs> <laughs> did no, Jared Leto did not. Mark Hamill. <laughs> How many of these have you seen? Okay. The fact that I've seen, seen I've seen, seen Oh, Jenny when you said Jared Leto, I thought you meant Jay Leno. Uh, so I was like, when was he the Joker? <laughs> I've now, I've now it's seen every movie movies. that has the Joker in it. Have you? Yeah. Have you Suicide seen the original Squad? Batman? Uh-huh, Suicide Squad? You've seen the original Batman? Uh-huh. With Caesar Rem- Wow. Yeah. It Does almost the worked. Joker outshine all the other performances? Because I've only others. Out- uh, not the suicide. Squad. I've only yeah. seen Jared Leto as Joker. No, 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 he did no, no. I mean, I mean, okay. I think so, at least. He's talking about in this movie. In this movie, not to say take him out of the movie, but if you ignore the the Joker just for a moment, everyone in this movie does great, right? With the exception of two people, annoying guy Long- and the Riddler. No, no, the annoying guy is the guy who's shotgun in the slot uh, truck. When he's no, like, oh, oh, that's a yeah. Okay, I thought you were talking that? about Long. 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 great. Long. 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 great. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Yeah. Oh. Can we just cut that out? And... Wait, what do you do? <laughs> he got the wrong boat scene <laughs> mixed up. <laughs> He was thinking about the one with the Russian ballet. <laughs> remember, the remember when I said that he should have done a citywide event? Mm-hmm. Right before the boat scene, he did. Mm-hmm. Remember when the guy who uh, was gonna reveal Batman's identity, and if they didn't, if Batman didn't turn, or if they didn't kill that that guy, he would kill a bunch of people. Yeah, he would have blown up a hospital. That was that a was, citywide event. That was before yeah. he said, "I'm gonna." Own the city. Yeah. Now that we, I, I, I want to compare Batman's actually. Um, who, who's the best Batman? The one who said this one that punches the Joker underwater. <laughs> no, he punches Harley Quinn. And then underwater. kisses Harley Quinn. Sorry. Did that happen in the movie? Yeah. He punches Harley oh, yeah, Quinn underwater, wait, like yeah. clocks and knocks her out. I don't know how I you, how believe. you, how, I don't know how you punch someone underwater with so much force to like clock them. So not that Batman. Yeah, that's the worst Batman. Actually. No, that's the best Batman ever. Who played that? Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's 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 think Just really for that quick. one scene. We got Adam West, and we've got the two guys before Adam West who were in like TV serials in the '40s that we don't care about. Then we've got Jack. No. What what is it? Then we've got Michael Keaton. Right. Is it then we've got it Val Kilmer. There? Oh, it's important. We've got George Clooney. The okay, I've one. already figured out which one's the worst. <laughs> when, then we've got Christian Bale. And then we've got... Ben Affleck. Yes, this Ben Affleck. Right? Who's, the best, who's the best, who's the worst, who's yeah. in the middle? Christian Bale's the best. Christian Bale's the best Batman, or is he in the best Batman movie? Both. Really? Yes. Okay. Oh, yeah. Michael Keaton, how how high up does he rank? Not high. Really? You don't like Michael Keaton as Batman? He's some scrawny, like, just nerd dude. Yeah, but that's... He wants to get nuts. Then what about... What about... Has I don't even know which one Val Kilmer's in. He's in Batman Forever. Oh god, okay. So that one's what bad. Don't cast joke. 
Fidel Castro. <laughs> Who who's the best Batman, Joey? Adam West. Who's the best Batman, Ari? I don't know. Who's the, who's the I don't know. Uh, I just got this one. Christian Bale. I agree with Wes. Who's the best Batman? No. Don't you do that to me. No one. George Clooney. Christian George Clooney. George. Al Gore. <laughs> I Al Gore. Clinton. We said Bill Clinton was that one. Yeah, Bill Michael Clinton. Keaton. Yeah, Bill Clinton was in this movie. Michael Keaton was a good And so one. was this senator, Patrick Leahy. So, final thoughts. Oh, Joey. Sucks. That's all you've got, Joey, for us. Is that's your final thought? Ari, having seen this for the first time, what are your final thoughts and was this movie worth it? Wes, having seen this movie for your 14th time now. It changes every time, doesn't it? Yeah, uh, how many Laos out of 10 would you rate this movie? I'm giving a couple. Oh yeah, that's a good one, all right. Uh, I love this movie, I still love it. Lucan, yeah. what did you think of this movie? I give it a good 10 out of 11. How many boat scenes out of 11 would you give it? I give it a good 10 out of 11. Alright, there you go. This movie's good, but it isn't perfect. No movie is. <laughs> too many boats. Except for this one. <laughs> no, no, have you ever seen <laughs> Batman Forever? <laughs> yeah. Too many boats. Second to 11 out of 11. <laughs> I hate Batman Forever. It's such a dumb movie. If you like this, you suck. We only have time for it today. We know. I didn't get to talk about this movie. You yeah, gotta talk about yeah. The movie. Dude, dude, the music's really good, and there's no CGI. What's the music? And also, who wins in the end, the Joker? There was or the CGI. Batman? Yeah, who wins in the end, the Joker or the Batman? Think about it. I think Harvey Dent wins. He no, <laughs> no he's, he's, the he's the only one who's dead. He's the only one who loses. <laughs> Rachel wins. We can agree <laughs> that he Joker loses. Wins. Maroney Joker wins. loses. Joker uh, Lau definitely loses. Turns <laughs> 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 out he was not good with calculations. He's pretty lousy yeah. at calculations. <laughs> that's, another oh, that is, that's another fun fact. That's another rule, that's dude. Good. <laughs> you go. You go. Look if he wins on multiple points, because if his entire objective was just to corrupt Harvey. Dead, then he, he, he definitely completely that. won. And in the movie, because of Joker's action, everyone hates Batman. They, they're chasing him down, they're destroying the bat signal. If if his whole goal was to not corrupt Batman, chaos. but to incite chaos and to but destroy again, the boats, to destroy <laughs> evidence <laughs> that people forget about the boats. <laughs> I think the boats were the, the only winners. The yeah. boats <laughs> explain that people won. And they can you cut out all <laughs> boats. <laughs> That's all we have time for. Today on this on, episode. Today on this episode. Today yeah. on this episode. A pun. If you like the video, we have things that exist. We have a wiki. We have an Instagram. I don't care if you go to either of those things, but they do exist. We got a like. We've got a dislike. We've got a comment. We've got a favorite. That doesn't exist. Scratch we that. We later. don't have a dislike. We have an, an add to playlist. You have a bell button? We have a bell button. Go ahead and smack that bell button. <laughs> Go ahead and smack that subscribe. You can lightly tap the like button though. I don't think hitting your phone three times in a row is a good idea. Yeah. yeah. Shut up. Oh. This episode is sponsored by. Oh, what are you... <laughs> and here's our favorite comment. No, Ari, you gotta do this. This episode is sponsored oh. by Faucets. Where's your water coming from? There, apparently. And here's our favorite comment of the week. Pwned last pwned. Wow, wow, it was probably you that did it. Oh, hey, hey what Wes! Line? Wes Lee Davis! Yes. What are you talking about next episode? What are we gonna talk about? Dark Knight Rises? <laughs> Amen! Oh, you this mean is, the second This is all we have time for on this episode of the hey, Dark Knight wait, Podcast. Hey, wait, This is the last pwn of the year, and I just want to say, it's been a great year here at home. Has it? Can you show us some of the things that we finished? Like, yes. uh, Donald Let's, Dan? let's, let's end this video, guys. Let's end this video. Pong! Hey, Pong! Oh, 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 oh. Hold on, and Let's do it, boys. Let's do the outro. We did. We did. Have a good day. Alright, see you guys. See you guys. Pong is my favorite show. Oh, I have one more announcement to make.